Hey everybody, Negro VMX is back. And you know, I made a decision between the last video and this one. I do want to kind of fill out as much of the map as I can. And uh, we're going to start doing that now. Um, there's a lot of secrets I didn't get. You know, I'm doing a walkthrough. I might as well show as much as possible. I'm not going for 100% souls. But I could try to go for 100% map completion at the least. And there's actually a secret here. Um, I, know, I don't know where it is, but there's a secret here. In this room, I know it. Um, I usually find it by throwing out axes randomly anyway. Oh, there it is. Okay. Right, truffle. Okay. I think I can remember where most of the secrets are. Let's see then. Alright, well, let me, um... Let me go back to the beginning. Because I have the paranoia soul, and there's a bunch of stuff to do. And I just realized there's also, um... A secret that I didn't get before... Um, I could have gotten in the last video, but I was so concerned with the damn, um, soul of the iron golem that I passed right by the area several times, I might add, without opening it up. So let me try and do that right now. Oh, it's not over here. Shit. Um, well, you know what? That's okay. I, uh, yeah, that's okay. I could go talk to Hammer and all that, but let's try and get a lot of, like, travel into this video. Let's try and, like, get shit done, huh? This is going to be the one where I travel all over the map, opening up areas that I didn't open up, and, you know, going through mirror rooms and stuff like that. Okay. Um, somewhere around. There it is. Okay. Oh, God. I'd love if some of you guys dropped your souls. Leather armor. Caviar. Alright. Well, this is a good shortcut, too, because this leads right up to where I was before, yeah. Boom! But I don't need to go through there. There's a mirror... Actually, yeah, there's a mirror room not too far from where I was, too, so... Oh! No souls. Oh well. Just one more would upgrade my axe. Fucking son of a bitch. Just one more would upgrade my axe. It's not a, it's a one star soul. Just one more would upgrade my fucking axe. I keep thinking I'm on luck build and I'm not. Oh well. I ain't gonna sit here and grind it out. Fuck that up. Like, why not try to fill out as much of the map as I can, right? Alright. Die. I've been this way quite a long time. I'm right, use the Paranoia Soul, and you can go through here. And I can get you this Tear of Blood. Pretty cool, huh? Okay. Um, there is a place in the wizardry lab I want to go, so I'll head there next. Let's get another zombie soul. Yay. Get out of here, you bother me. Ooh, there's a potion I just never grabbed. That is fucking crazy. There's also a few, like, little tiny portions of the map that I haven't filled in, and I was like, ah, fuck it. But now I'm thinking, you know what? Doing a walkthrough, might as well try and, like I said, go for as close to 100% map completion. I'm not getting all the souls, because that would take forever. I don't got months to do this playthrough, but... I mean, I do. I'm just not going to do it for that long. <coughs> I mean, technically, it's not like I, I could have a time limit. I could take as long as I want. It's not like YouTube's going anywhere. Oh, can I get up this way? That doesn't matter, I just go through this way. This is actually this actually leads right where I want to go anyway. Ugh, this shit. I wish there was like an upgrade to that that you can just like bash it away with your sword or whatever. Annoying. 
Jeez, that's so stupid. And then I gotta go back through that. That's the fun part. Yeah, I already went down there once before, but there is a mirror in here, so let's... Uh, grab myself a rosary. Okay, um... Looking at the map here... I am going to go to the Garden of Madness next. Because it seems logical. Here, just turn into a bat so I can do this with one hand. Which sounds dirty, but... Seems I can keep one hand on the D-pad and one hand on the mouse. I'll run out of magic eventually, but I think I can get through this without running out. Okay. Chase the cursor, Matt! Chase the cursor! There we go. <laughs> Alright, so onwards to the Garden of Madness! Which I just have to kind of take the long way, because I'm not near a warp. Well, I'm not taking the long, long way. I'm going to a warp. <laughs> Ooh, lucky I hit him. Especially since I was, like, looking at the map. Ugh. Every time I kill one of those guys, I hope for another Axe Armor Soul, but... Alas, it does not happen. And yes, I just said alas. That happened. That's a thing. Is there something over here? I always feel like there's something right there, but there isn't. Honestly, I really don't believe the game when it tells me that Axe Armor is a one-star soul. It always takes so long to get a bunch of them. I think the rarity system's a little flawed in this one. Alright, I'm gonna go up here, Garden of Madness. Okay, there are no mirror rooms here, but there are um, a couple of... I got corpse weed. All right. A couple of, like, secrets that I never got. Um, let's see. Whoa! Oh, fucking hell. I forgot that I could actually do that. Another Une soul. You die! Um... I gotta get up there. Alright, yeah. Yeah, there's a secret there that I never got. Just sort of systematically looking at the map and the ninja suit. Is that any good? Let me see. Oh. Compared to what I have. Oh, fuck your fucking Donkey Kong ass. City, I'm like, fuck your fucking Donkey Kong ass. Alright, there's no mirrors in the Dark Chapel. Um, thinking. Where else do I need to go? Well, I guess I gotta go down a subterranean hell. Nope, not that way. Alrighty then. Try to get under it. Don't know why I thought I could. Right. Subterranean hell. There we go. I don't want to use the mouse. <laughs> And there's like one thing in the silenced rooms I want to get to. It's still like one of those pro self souls. It probably ain't gonna happen, but it's like not that important. It just makes you move in water better. Hey now, the fuck, man. I could have done this before, but it's actually a lot easier once you have bat company. I'll go up this way. You! Alright, 
much. Oh. Somewhere around here. Oh, fuck. We're running out of magic doing this shit. Oh, got it. I heard the thing open. And that is the Eversing. Which is really good armor. Um... Everything else is lower, and that's not because it's worse, it's because all rocks' suit brings everything else up. But defense is what armor is meant to do. I'm just head over to the silence runes. How much of the map do I have filled up? 80.3. There's also like an, uh, two entire big areas that I haven't been to yet. Right, this is a save point. Yeah. Might as well walk over there. It ain't a long walk to the silence runes. Yeah! Yo. Oh, the hell. Once again, I was looking at the top screen. That's the thing about DS games. You're only seeing the action, but there's also all the stats and the map and everything, you know. I should have taken the upper floor. That would the upper path would have been easier. Die already. Well, either way, I'm going up from here. Another skull archer soul. Da 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 da. Die already. Oh, I got the larva soul. It just shoots one of those motherfuckers out. It's just not that exciting to look at. Oh, drop your guard, you asshole. Thank you. Asshole. I don't even need the back, just go up there. Alright, and here I can grab myself a super potion. Alright, um... Alright, clock tower would be the next step. Just gonna head down to the warp, since the clock tower is really far away. Jeez Louise, man. Level the fuck up! I am level 47, motherfuckers. Don't fuck with me. Alright. Yeah, clock tower. Cursed clock tower. It's not really near the warp, though. Actually, you know what? Oh, God. It may be quicker... Let me look at the map. It may be quicker to war to go to the other tower. Uh, yeah, it'd be quicker to actually warp over here to the Condemned Tower. It's actually closer to the entrance there. This is where I need to go. Oh, my God, and there's also the Demon Guest House. There's, like... Little spots I haven't filled out. I'm seeing that on the map right now. I need to go there anyway, but I'll do this first. And there's part of the condemned chapel that's not filled out that I'm seeing now. There's also some items there that I know I can get. <sighs> well, that's close by here. So I'll just walk back after I do this. <laughs> Fucking... Dark Lord's work is never done, huh? What the fuck was- I'm looking at the fucking map! Oh, 
I do gotta pay attention in this area. This is not, like, you know, fun and games. Ah. Alright. Might as well just make a quick stop down here to fill up my life. Okay, the whole thing just stuttered on me. I was it seems the game likes to do that when it's saving, if you're playing in an emulator. But I don't have a DS capture card, so... Oh, I need to go up there, though. Looks like it's going too fast for me to sneak up there with the bat form. Oh, I don't know why I think thought that wouldn't hit me. I was like, hey, I'm good. I'm still behaving like I had the flying guy. Alright. Alright. Hey, now! She be doing that shit to me? Push me around? I'm fucking Dracula, motherfucker! Oh, it's pronounced Dracula. Uh, I'm gonna get those comments anyway. I like pronouncing it the correct way, and not like just Bella Glagosi did. I mean, you know. I thought I got anything against Bella Lugosi. It's just... I can't go this way. I mean, I can, but it would suck. I gotta go this way. End result's the same. Ugh, back through this shit. I mean, there is an alternative, but it's a little out of the way. Oh, hell, whoa! God, I just so preferred the bat form in Aria of Sorrow. Well, I prefer that game overall. This is a great sequel, but it's just... I do prefer the first one. Too bad I never got a threequel. I would like to see in like Tears of Sorrow, they could have called it. Okay, I can get down to where I need to go very quickly from here, so. All I need to do is this. Huh, that was badass. Okay, hold on. Kill you is a little bit up here that I haven't been to. With a tasty meat. As opposed to that gross meat, I guess. <laughs> and then I just go through here and there's an area that I haven't filled up. This is the fill up and mirror room episode of Castlevania Dawn of Sorrow. Oh, I can't just do that, I gotta like follow the proper... Can I? Yes, I can. Yeah, I knew there was items around here. A high fucking potion! Do you wanna get high? Hand slipped off the deep pad. God damn Xbox controller! I actually like this controller. I'm not using my, uh, let's go Titsu. I'm not using my Afterglow, I'm using like a, just a regular wired GameStop controller. I may use the Afterglow for more things that require a lot of precision in the future. I don't know, I thought about digging that thing out. It's an awesome controller. It's just that it is just hard plastic, so um, your hands can get kind of sweaty. And I will see. Alright, so next I'm going to head to the Demon Guest House, fill out some of the rooms there, and there's a mirror room. It's that part where I was like, oh, I forgot to fill out that part. Ah, fuck it. And, oh, it's a little it's below me. Below me. Below me! <laughs> it's like that scene in Young Frankenstein, which me and my friends just watched earlier tonight. It was cool. We watched Young Frankenstein. One of my, my best friend, Andrew, had never seen it. So he was seeing that for the first time, which is awesome. And uh, there was the part that 
Elevate me! Right here? Fucking classic. Alright, over to the demon guest house to fill out part of that annoying bone pillar room, but that's okay because I could just kill them all really quickly and not worry because I could just fly straight up. Before I had to worry about having to step on the bone pillars in the proper way, you know? And also that slide puzzle area has a mirror room. Trying not to exclusively look at the map because I don't want to run into enemies and do stupid shit. It's through here. Yes, presivo! Which makes me think of Explos Explosivo, which is a fucking song by um, Tenacious D. I suppose I could be thinking of worse things. Yeah, see, it's a lot easier if you just kill these motherfuckers. Oh, fucking hell. I'm literally only coming here for percentage points. For the map. I wasn't originally going to do this, but I was like, eh. Fuck it. Here yeah, goes the heater. Whoa, hello! Not a single soul from all these guys. I mean, that's a three-star soul. But that's cr- Oh, I'm going to have enough magic to reach up there. No! Really? I didn't think of that. Oh my god. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Regenerate, regenerate. Jump, jump, bat. Do it. Okay. I need to get into the room above that, though, so let me... God, what do I have? That... I have... I don't want to... I have two mana prisms, but I don't want to use them. I could always get up there the old-fashioned way. I was overusing my axes. I wasn't paying attention to how much fucking mana I had. Oh my god, he knocked me into next week! You! You! Alright, I filled it out. <laughs> That's all I needed to do! And these guys are like, huh? Huh? Where is he? Where'd he go? Which way did he go? Explosivo! Could have gotten in here and just, like, gotten more hearts, too. I didn't think of that. Oh, well. Alright, so... I am going to get myself to a warp point. And then I'm going to go over back over to the pinnacle. And that's where we're going to go next time, because, you know... Stuff. We and the Woo and the Nessa the Kapapa, as Tanya says. <laughs> Pinnacle. I'll see you guys there! Looty!